<clears throat> Ready there, buddy. What's going on? What? Minnow, you've been giving us a lot of carp about this whole fish thing, and I eel you. No trout. I'm your sole brother after all, know what I bream? We don't want you to feel orca word. We're just trying to kelp you. I have literally no idea what any of you are talking about. We just hate to see you like this. Know what I'm salmon? We could do batter if you let us fry. Here's some whale song to make you real at home. Wow, it's beautiful. If only we could understand what they're saying. Majestic. Uh, look, can you please just get out? I've had a cup to here. I mean, I mean, I've had it up to here. Ah, just get out! <sighs> what can we do? Well, I think we should keep them away from the sea and rivers and swimming pools and just water altogether. And other fish, also mirrors. And fish-related things like chip slip surgery in Japan. And daylight in general, so we can't see anything else I didn't think of. Well, we might as well lock him inside a box and bury him in the basement. Yes! That's exactly what we should do! Dad! Uh, do you have any solutions that won't break our hearts? I'm afraid we're going to have to be rational. We have to release him back into his natural habitat. Hip, 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 hooray, we're having such a happy day. Hip, 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 hooray, we hope we do. Why is everyone crying? Nobody's crying. What are we doing here? Can't we just go home? Well, this is your home now. It's okay, buddy. We can still stay in touch. Look, I got us these walkie-talkies. Let me help you move in. Well, now you've got the whole pond to yourself. <laughs> Guys, what is going on? Seriously. We will always love you. <laughs> Favorite. Uh, I'm right here, you know. Just kidding. <laughs> we're doing it for you, son. If it were up to me, you'd be blindfolded and locked up in a basement. What? <laughs> you all saw him at the pet store. This is what he really wanted. <laughs> what do you think you're doing? This is a big turning point in his life. Ah! But he'll get used to it. He just has to hold on. Ah! It's a big leap for him to go back to his natural habitat. But he gave us a very clear sign. Ah! You just have to hang on in there. Hey, you! Follow that! Ah! Ah! Life isn't always a straight path, you know. And sometimes things just come to a dead end. Sad, but how about some ice cream to cheer us all up, huh? Ah, come on! Three sundaes, please. And Richard, honey, what do you want? Nuts. You abandoned me? Then go for ice cream! <laughs> Somebody please tell me what is going on! Sorry, buddy, but we were just so sad when you were looking at those fish in the pet store. We tried to reconnect you with your roots, but we could see it wasn't enough. So he kind of white-fanged you. What are you guys talking about? You know, the way you looked at the fish and then back at us with that sad face. Oh, that. I wasn't looking at the fish. I was trying to guilt trip you into buying me the huge tank. You were trying to emotionally blackmail me into buying you something? Well, looks like somebody's shown their true colors. You really are... A water <laughs> Absolutely not. Okay, well, if I work even more night shifts and stop eating dinner, then maybe I could save us enough money. Well, I suppose that's fair. Of course, I never knew my real parents or what my life would have been like in the ocean. Well, that's true. We cruelly took you in, clothed you, fed you, looked after you. I suppose we still owe you so much. <sighs> You're too good. No one can guilt trip like a mother. 